But he did try to fight me. So I'm walking into the kitchen. He's walking out. And he leans his shoulder into me. And I go, uh, did you just lean your shoulder into me? And he goes, maybe you should watch where you're going. And I started to laugh. I go, I'm sorry. Are you starting to fight with me? And he goes, uh, yeah, not that it's going to be much of a fight. And I was like, all right, man, front lawn right now. Let's go. And he goes, no, no, not, not now. Like three weeks. I'm like, three? Who are you, fucking Rocky? What do you mean, three weeks? You got to go turn some tires over and shit? Like, what? He goes, I got to go look up some videos online. I'm like, oh, okay. Now, listen, outwardly, when he said three weeks, I was mocking him. But on the inside, when he said three weeks, I was like, phew. Because I'm at an age where I pull muscles. And I pull muscles doing shit that I shouldn't pull a muscle doing. Like, not too long ago, I pulled a muscle in my right shoulder. Uh, wiping my ass. I went back too quick and I didn't tuck my core. It's all core nowadays, I don't fucking know. But I went back too quick and all my wife heard when she walked by the door was, oh no! <laughs> Listen, guys, if I get a stretch before I shit, you can kill me tonight. Do you know what I mean? Like, if, if you walk into the bathroom later and I'm like this and you're like, what are you doing, man? I'm getting ready to poop. Like, you can, I don't need to come out of the bathroom. You can kill me in there. Now, here's the deal. By the way, you couldn't do what my dad did now. This is, this is definitely something that you could not get away with now. We have raised a different generation of kids. You guys know that, right? We have raised a generation of spoiled, entitled pussies. You understand that, right? Now, we can clap all you want, but you know whose fault it is? Yeah, they didn't raise themselves, guys. It's our fault. And we've coddled them to the point that it's ridiculous. Do you know that in a lot of states in our great country, they've outlawed dodgeball? Do you know why? Because they say it humiliates the children. Round of applause. By the way, that's ironically why we played the fucking game to begin with. <laughs> right? I was like, who are we making cry today, right? Round of applause, people who remember playing dodgeball. Round of applause. And if I said after the show, we're gonna clear out the tables and play some dodgeball, who would play some dodgeball? Yeah! Because we all have that shared experience, right? Everybody in here remembers what that red rubber tastes like on your lips, right? And your eyes are watering, your nose starts to run, you try to get off the court. Nine other balls hit you and you're like, I'm out already, shit, fuck, I am out! They'll never have that experience, will they? So I call my dad on the phone, because I know my son wants to fight me. I call him on the phone, I'm like, hey man, we all fought you, right? He goes, yeah. And I said, I, I seem to remember you being a little more violent than you needed to be. And he said, no, yeah, you, you remember correctly. And I said, why, 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 why? And he goes, well, listen, man, he wants to win, right? I said, yeah, he said, you have to win. You have to win. Because if you don't win, the power changes at your house. And then you try telling him to take out the trash tomorrow. He's gonna slap you in the face and be like, you take the trash out, bitch. Don't make me fuck you up again. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God. He said, this is how... And then he said something, by the way, that I will never forget. I go, I have to win? He said, Josh, even if somebody ends up calling the police, you have to win. And I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> Now listen, I'm not a violent dude. My dad was more adept at that. And now I did have three older brothers, so I am really good at mental torture. So I was like, that's kind of where I'll lean on. So I hang up the phone and I turn around and my wife is there and she looks right at me. She goes, are you fighting Jacob? And I said, no, 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 I'm not gonna fight him. It's gonna be something, we're gonna do something in the front lawn, but it's not gonna be like a fight. And she said, uh, why, why don't you just tell him that you're the grown up?" and he's the kid, and that's it. He does what you say. And I'm like, nah. I said, that's not gonna work. And she said, why? I said, I'm not sure if you were there, but he basically slapped me in the face with his dick in the kitchen. Like, <laughs> there's only one response. 
She goes, I don't like it. I said, I'm not saying it's the right response. I'm just saying it's the only one that I know, do you know? And she said, I don't think this is a good idea. And then I maybe got a little too cocky. And I said, I'll let you know when I have a bad idea. And she was like, oh, okay. You're gonna let me know? And I said, yeah. And she goes, oh, okay. 